that is the acting chief justice of Nigeria, Justice Ibrahim Tanko Muhammad, taking his oath of office and allegiance at the council chambers of the Asorok presidential villa. Speaking, President Muhammad Buhari says he acted based on the request of the Code of Conduct Tribunal. Justice Walter Onoge would have acted swiftly to spare our judicial arm further disrepute by removing himself from superintending over it while his trial lasted. Unfortunately, he has not done so. Instead, the nation has been treated to the sourced spectacle of a judicial game of wits in which the Chief Justice of Nigeria and his legal team have made nonsense of the efforts of the Code of Conduct Tribunal to hear the allegation on merit and conclude the trial as quickly as possible, considering <clears throat> the nature of the times in which we live. Accordingly, I hereby suspend the Honorable Justice Walter Nkanu Samuel Onogen as the Chief Justice of Nigeria pending final determination of the case against him as the Code of Conduct Tribunal. In further compliance with the same order of the Code of Conduct Tribunal, I hereby invite Honorable Justice Ibrahim Tanko Mohammed, be, being the next most senior justice in the Supreme Court, to come forward to take the judicial oath as Chief Justice of Nigeria in an acting capacity. He also noted that Justice Walter Onogen should have stepped aside and saved the nation's judiciary for their embarrassment. As a government, we cannot stand by wailing and wringing our hands helplessly, but to give full backing and support to those brave elements within the judiciary who act forthrightly, irrespective of who is involved. As you are all aware, the fight against corruption is one of the tripod of policies promised to Nigerians by this administration. President Muhammad Buhari says his administration would remain resolute in its resolve to tackle corruption. The acting chief justice of Nigeria, however, did not speak to newsmen as he left the presidential villa quietly. Friday's evening suspension of CJN Water Onogen by President Muhammadu Buhari will no doubt remain shocking throughout the weekend and even for weeks, months or even years to come. There is obviously going to be heavy legal fireworks as many will be asking whether the president have the right to suspend the nation's number one judicial officer. From the Asorok Presidential Villa, I'm Ikaro Atta, ITV News, Abuja.